So 90 Days to Maui, what is it? It is an adventure. I am overweight, uncoordinated, over 40, and I have decided, you know, it's gonna be a brilliant idea. Let's learn to surf. So I want more adventure in my life, and I'm gonna give this a go. Now, I am in no condition to get up on a surfboard. I will probably damage myself if I attempt it right now. However, I have vision of safely surfing um, in Maui when I go to see my best friend in about 90 days. So I'm having a 90 day to Maui challenge and that's what this is all about. So welcome to my adventure. Thanks. <laughs> Hi, Mandy Lynn here and it's day 10 on my 90 day to Maui challenge. And today I want to talk a little bit about some problems I experienced while I was doing the Tap Out XT program in my training to go surfing. Um, the biggest challenge I had was basically my girls. Um, I almost gave myself a flip and black eye today with them. Um, basically because normally I double bag them and I'm wearing two sports bras just to kind of keep them in place and um, for whatever reason I only had one on today and <laughs> As I was exercising, what was like about to escape out the side? I mean, it was just, yeah, it was not pretty. Um, it's not the best sports bra in the world. It's one of the warehouse specials. I have better made by Champion and stuff, but it was in the wash. So anyway, that's a little bit of my dilemma. And um, yeah, the other day I went to Kirk's, um, which is a really lovely shopping space here in Wellington. and. It's about the only place in Wellington where there are professional bra fitters, like people that can actually figure out what size you are and give you proper fitting for your bras. Um, so I got this one, just behind me. I have this lovely little, um, well not so little, it's huge. When <laughs> they told me what size it was, I about crapped. Um, <laughs> I'm a size 16, which I was like, ooh, I'm a 16? I thought that was quite cool. H. Yeah, H. I didn't even know. that. That's for like, holy H. Um, I did not even know that you could go up to that size. So, um, yeah. Um, a little bit entertaining. Um, so, basically, when I'm trying to bag these things while I'm exercising, they're, they're like counterweights. And I'm uncoordinated to start with, but to have these things flying around while I'm trying to do my exercise does not make me any more coordinated. So what I really need is an amazing bra that is going to actually do what I need it to do and hold the girls in place and lift them and let me have a little less of the counterweight thing happening because when they're swinging, oh lord, do you know why I'm going to be near them? Um, so anyway, um, what I'm going to do is I'm posting a challenge and that challenge is to any bra manufacturers out there who want to have their products tested on these girls in this 90 day challenge, I say send them on. We'll see if anybody goes up to the challenge, otherwise I'm still going to be using my other ones until I find um, something new. But Anyway, um, I thought it would be a wonderful opportunity for some plus size bra manufacturers to be like, you know what, we're up for that challenge and we can harness those bad girls and, um, and show me what you're made of, quite literally. But anyway, that's kind of my random, <laughs> my randomness for today. Oh Lord. It was a great morning though. Um, I got up at five, not to exercise, but I got up at five because it was the dawn parade for its Anzac Day here in New Zealand, which is kind of like Veterans Day in the States. And my son and I and my intern went and we filmed, um, or we photographed the remaining World War II veterans um, in Paraparaumu Beach and stayed the night in Coco, our caravan, um, so that we'd be up in time to be able to do it. And yeah, it was a beautiful, beautiful morning. Got to meet some really amazing um, soldiers. Even got to meet a Wren, which was quite exciting. And she was um, a signal woman in World War II. And she was quite excited to, um, to chat with me too as another service woman. Um, and um, when I told her I had spent 10 years in the US Navy, she thought that was quite cool. And she was very happy to let me photograph her then. Um, but yeah, that's, um, that's been my morning, it was exciting, um, came home, slept heaps, and then got up and exercised, so anyway, this is a result of that. Take care, hope you have an amazing day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Eric, are you ready for me?
up into a hurdler. Stretch that bad boy. Other side. Back. Push the hips back. Chest up. Head up. Chest up. Here, go back in. Give me two. <laughs> and one. Let's go. And the kick out to the side. Thank <laughs> you. 